Hey, hey, it's your broads. We're calling our squad. Our squad who loves Broadway. The Broadway Broad Squad. We hella love musicals and we review them all day. It's Jen and Sarah. Your fairy god broads. Hey. Places. Hi, I'm Jen. And I'm Sarah. And, and we're, we're the Broadway, Broadway Broads. If you're new here, welcome to the Broadway Broad Squad. You guys, we are on location in New, new York, York City. City. Oh my gosh. Yes, we're here. <laughs> we're back. We're back. This particular review is for Company, and that is playing at the Bernard B. Jacobs Theater. And Squad, we get to check another box off of our Quest for 41, uh, because this is one we've never been to. So we're really, really, really excited. We love seeing theater at any theater, but when we get to check one off, it's kind of nice. It is. It's a little special. It's a little special. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so we saw an 8 p.m. show, and we where did. did we sit? We sat in row BB. It was seats 101 and 102, and we will gush about these seats a little bit later, but yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. so a quick synopsis on yeah. Company. Um, it's Bobby's 35th birthday party, and all her friends keep asking, why isn't she married? Why can't she find the right man, and isn't it time to settle down and start a family? As Bobby searches for answers, she discovers why being single, being married, and being alive in 21st century New York City can drive a person crazy. <laughs> um, so real quick, so um, this show, um, I guess you can say was reimagined, right? It was done in, in the West End. Um, it was originally done with a male lead. Bobby was played by a man. Um, but this one, there's a lot of gender swapping going on in that case, and for, the, for the role. So Bobby is played by a woman. Um, and so, you know, I personally loved it. Well, I'll talk a little bit more as we dive a little bit deeper into it, but I'm a huge fan of the change. Yeah, and I'm I'm very new to this. In fact, just a month ago, we were together and we, we threw it on. The cast recording had no idea we were gonna be seeing it. Hoped, we had tickets back in 2020. That didn't happen. Yeah. Um, so it was new to me. So the whole gender swap, the whole deal like was, my head was spinning. So yeah, we'll get into that though. Yeah, but really, really enjoyed it. Really, really yeah, did, absolutely. Yeah. Um, okay, so getting into the theater, of course, we are in different times, so we just want to touch on that. This theater was very thorough in the vaccination checks, but felt very safe. Um, the theater is also dry. They're not serving um, any drinks or any food, and I'm sure that is also just being cautionary um, because of the, the yeah, situation. Less, less dealing with the mask coming off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what we did do is we headed over directly to the merch. Of um, course. Of course we did, and you know your bras had to get some merch. Um, so I got my lapel pin and it's so cute it really is. oh i love it and sarah got a shot glass that comes in like the cutest little box and it says i'll, I'll drink, drink to that. that and the other side has the new york logo yeah, of it. yeah the same so. one as the pin so super, yeah super really really cute. really cute also have to mention um so aj who was absolutely busy selling a merch um, but he recognized your bronze. Yeah. So he um, recognizes from our October binge. Mm -hmm. He also worked merch at Ancient Crowd where I picked up the vinyl. Mm -hmm. And so that was really, really yeah, sweet. Really, so really hi, cool. AJ. Yeah, hi, AJ. <laughs> yeah, that was really cool. All right, so we headed to our seats. So now let's talk a little bit about the seats that you scored. <sighs> yes. I, I sat down and I was like, Holy shit. There, 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 was, there was tears that were shed. Yes. Yeah, I mean, and I even, and you all know I take the aisle, but yeah. I did even say, Sarah, if you want the aisle, and she was like, no, but I'm so happy, hold me. It, she it was, yeah. it was, it was actually for me, it was more like watching the Sarah show. I was I so know. excited for you. It was I really, was. yeah, so these seats, okay. The seats. They're, they weren't front row, but there was nobody in front of us. No. So it was like the rope bees extended out yeah. and we had and wrapped nobody. around nobody. So we had tons of leg room. I mean, I think I kicked out my legs. Yeah, so did I. I, I did too. And they were comfortable. There was lots of room. Yeah. Our thighs weren't besties. I mean, it was. And in most New York theaters, our thighs are best friends. Yeah. Yeah. So, so it was, yeah, it was, it, that was fantastic. Yeah. So yeah. Seats were great. So yeah, thank you. Once again, yes, you freaking hit yes, the jackpot. Yes, if there was any time that I wanted to, that was oh, the time. Well, thank so, you. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, so let's dive in a little bit to the show. Oh. Um, okay, so technically, um, there are a lot of moving parts to this set. Um, and for our show, it, it worked quite seamlessly. Yeah, there right? was no problems. And the set was very um, minimalistic. Yeah. Um, but it was also, I love the way it was um, monochromatic. There was like a gray tone, but then you had this neon 
just like you see, mm -hmm. you know, on the cover, you had this neon going through it. It went up and down. The band was on top. So it was, it was technically, in, it was technically fun to watch yeah. and happy to see that, that we didn't have any issues. Not at all. Not at all. I have yeah. seen some media that they have run into a few technical issues. So it was nice to see, yeah. not to see any of yeah. that, right? Yeah. Um, and, but also that monochromatic look really sort of helped all of those costumes pop. Yeah, like, they did. Yeah. Which is next bringing us to costumes. So the costumes, it takes place now. So it's everyday wear. But then you have Bobby in this beautiful red uh, jumpsuit, mm -hmm. right? That she just looks fantastic yeah, in. Is. And then everybody else in like everyday clothing, except for Sarah's queen. Patty, of course, looked absolutely stunning in everything. Did. I she, her shoes. She did. She, and, uh, and even when she did have costume change, the shoes were the same style. So it like gave her that character like yeah. depth through the entire thing. Like this is the, she still dresses up, but she stays within a, those uh, that uh, fur. That, that, oh, yeah. Uh, when she dropped that fur and showed her shoulder, I was like, oh, <laughs> like, I mean, yeah. come on. Yeah. Um, and yeah. then also you loved the the number, the TikTok number. Um, and so when all the characters came out yeah. as Bobby. As Bobby in, in yeah. the red. And, and it just, and to me, that popped against that gray. It really did. And then even seeing Patty in a, in a red within her still fancy, mm -hmm. but had the red, you know, sparkly dress on just... Just loved that. Just Absolutely. Loved that. And I do have to say, Patty made some eye contact with Sarah several times oh, throughout the, the show. Oh, and I, I swear it was the Sarah company show because I would look over at Sarah and she'd have tears, just happy tears. Uh, is your neck okay from like your jaw just like smiling the whole time? Like, <laughs> yeah, I, I did get the like tension smile headache that I sometimes get. And Broadway thank God shows. we have masks on because we're like, oh my God. <gasps> The whole time. Yeah, so. so nobody could see my whimpering <laughs> except for you. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's talk a little bit about this cast. So we usually do like standout performances, but the you fact can't. is, yeah. this is an all star cast. So, first of all, Miss Katrina Lank, okay, Patty Lapone, Matt Doyle, Christopher Fitzgerald, Christopher Siever, Jennifer Samard, Terrence Archie, Itai Benson, Bobby Conti, Nikki Renee Daniels, Claiborne Elder. Uh, Greg Hildreth and Manu Narayan and Rashidra Scott. Hello, the entire cast. We've seen them, like pretty much everyone except for Claiborne, which hello. Hello, Claiborne. Hi. <laughs> uh, uh, hi. Why yeah, haven't okay, we seen Sorry, him? but anyway. <laughs> wow, we saw enough of him last night. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but anyway, the, the entire cast. So strong. Phenomenal. Yeah. Every single person. Clearly, I mean, Katrina is Perfect. leading the show as Bobby, but it is an ensemble piece and... and it's so clear that they have some like, you know, stellar performers on stage. Yeah. They're just, just seamlessly and, like, and, and, and yeah. they have to do it all in within this little tiny box and perform and yeah. do all of this. I mean, just, mm -hmm. yeah. Perfection. Yeah. So as far as standout performances go for your broads, I mean, really the yeah. entire cast, the entire so. cast, <laughs> but we can give you some moments. Yeah, we absolutely. can give you some moments. Absolutely. So, so what first, are some so first for me opening, just because again, not familiar with the show. Um, I just recently talked with my friend Judy about it. I said, I'm gonna listen to the cast album and not even a week later, you and I were in a car together and I listened to it and I really enjoyed it. I mean, it's Steven Sondheim. How can you not enjoy right. it, right? Um, but the opening number, letting me meet everybody, mm -hmm. all of the couples was, I love that. Next favorite scene for me was David, Love him. Oh, we saw him in Waitress. So he's so good. He's yeah. so good. Um, so David, Jenny, and Bobby on the steps, the the stoops in New York, and they're and I guess back in the day it was them smoking a they joint. Would smoke a joint. Yeah. And so in this one they're smoking vape pens, and it's hilarious. It's, great. it's, it's hilarious. Great. And Christopher has some beautiful calves. I will say that. Too. Right. Right. Yes, he does. <laughs> was he a swimmer before? I want to know. I, I want to know. know. Anyway, so those were some some of mine. That then the next one we talked about Claiborne already, but Barcelona. And I know again my friend Judy who has questioning how this would change in the gender swap. Mm -hmm. It was fantastic. Yeah, and that boy, it was juicy. Number was really good. Yeah, the, all of that. Yeah. yeah. So what about you? I, I mean, I come mean, on, come on, go ahead, I'll Sarah. I take a guess of what my favorite moment was, but ladies who lunch. I'll drink to that. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> so just the whole culmination of it, like. That, that particular song, I mean, I am getting older, so it's starting to take different meanings for me than it did, you know, 20, 30 years ago. Um, and then also getting to see it on Broadway with Patti LuPone, it just all culminated. And I was a, a mess. I and, know I and, was, and I was like, why am I It was falling? a Friday night audience, and before she even sang a note, when the, just the piano started, 
the entire audience started clapping. So we knew yeah. they all, you know, there's love RIP to, you know, to Prince Stephen, mm -hmm. but also knowing that everyone in that theater knew what was coming too. Oh yeah. And I mean, Patty just gave it to us. Iconic. And she yeah, so that us. moment, that's for me, I, that moment will, I will remember that forever. Aww. So definitely um, yeah. the moment for yeah. me for the show. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. We're at intermission. I can't. I think I might have grabbed your thigh at one point of the show. <laughs> you you kind of did. You did. You did. And I saw. She, I saw. I know. Me. I know. I saw. She, I know. Had Patty and Sarah made some eye contact there. Dreams uh, were made. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, wow, wow. I mean, we were literally in like the front row. Yeah. I don't know? know if you could have got better seats. Yeah. Though, so. I don't, Congratulations yeah, on yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. For you, my friend. For oh. you. Yeah. So first show in New York. Are you happy? Oh, so thrilled. Okay, all right, let's we'll go. Check you soon. Okay, let's go. Bye. Um, okay, so uh, we like to ask this question. So, repeat attend or not, Jenny? I'm gonna say no. While I enjoyed it and it was a really fun show, it's not something that I need to see again. I'm being honest. Yeah, so. I'm gonna say no only because I feel like I saw it. Like I saw pa okay. the, the cast. We saw Patty Lapone. This this gender swap. I feel I don't ever want to see it with a man playing Bobby again. Like I feel like I saw it. Like this. I mean, okay. I saw Patty well, Lapone. Yeah. Like I don't know. Yeah. Uh, so I'm gonna say no. Like I don't need to see it again. I saw it. Like wow. Yeah. I mean, granted, if y'all want to take me to see it, yeah. I'll, I mean, I'll go. right. Right. I mean, if Patty. <laughs> yeah. But you know, like for me, the the songs were fun. But because I grew up with my mom and, and me still are obsessed with Barbra Streisand, these songs, Being Alive and um, Ladies Who Lunch, to me, they're, they're Barbra songs. Right, and I know right. they're not, but to me, they are. And so I remember when I hear them, I think of it that way, not within the show. Right. But yeah, so I don't need to see it again. But still a phenomenal yes, show. Highly yes. recommend you see it. So you good. The, the cast you get to see, I mean, I, I, it, yeah, it leaves me speechless. Like, it's so good. So, like, get so to the So you see theater. why it did so well on the West End, right? Yeah. So what do you think? Do you see any Tony predictions? Mm. Do you? I mean, it, it will be hit. It will hit for revival, right? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Absolutely. Yeah. And I, I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll have to do, we'll have to do a deep dive on some Tony stuff for yeah. that. Because there are multiple revivals. Let us know revivals. in the comments yeah. below what you think if this is something that. And also yeah. comment below if you would repeat attend, if you've seen yeah, it. Yeah, if you've you seen it. Yeah. Attend or not, right. we'd love if you've seen, or if you've seen the original and then saw this, I'd like to know your thoughts on the yeah. comparison between them. Absolutely. So. so this is where we typically would break and show you guys some curtain call footage. Um, so we like to ask because, you know, a lot of theaters will just be up front and say, yes, you can record one, you know, mm -hmm. the curtain call or, you know, whatever. Um, we asked the usher and she gave us the advice and was like, um, I wouldn't, you're up front and it could be the day that Patty decides to say something. And we decided that it just was not worth not it. Not today, Patty. <laughs> and what's funny is, did you hear the two gentlemen that came in after and he had his phone on and, he, and the other man said to him, turn your phone off. We don't want Patty to see us yeah. with our phone on. We you know, we were like, we were we, like, yeah, we were like, we feel you, we, we feel you. So we did not, yeah. we did not feel So it. no curtain call no, we didn't. But, but we do want to, we, we did have a really cool special moment. We ran into Shoshana from B-Way show, yeah. if you follow her. Um, and it was her 30th birthday and she came in this beautiful pink gown sitting right a pink gown sat right in front and it was just lovely to see her yeah. celebrating her 30th birthday with Bobby who was having her 35th birthday it was yeah, really, really it was, cool um, I like so it. she looked she beautiful. did she did we went and we we had a we had went and raised a glass with her after the show and yeah. that was that was really nice so yeah happy birthday show. happy birthday <laughs> it's giveaway time be sure to read the description box below for all the rules for our giveaway. And the giveaway is a very hard to get <laughs> yes. playbill for company. So if you would like to win this playbill, we would like for you to comment below. And in honor of Sarah getting to check off seeing Patti Lapone on Broadway, we want to know who is the one person you most want to see on Broadway. So comment below uh, with that as your as your. So uh, fill in the question. blank. Yeah, the yeah, person the I would most like to see on Broadway is... All right, thank you so, so yes, much for joining us, squad. Thank you, and we'll see you on the other side. Curtain. Curtain. Oh, that was a fun video. What'd you think? I loved it. I had a great time. What did, did you guys think? Yeah, did you guys love it? Did you love it? Huh, huh, huh? Well, if you did, 
Guess what you should do? You should definitely like it. And you should subscribe and hit that bell notification so that you know every time that your broads drop content. Yay! We'll see you on the other side. Bye! Bye! Your fairy god broads. Hey!